the first of the all weather championship finals now this is a two-year-old championship final over five and a half furlongs not to a hundred a oh, small disappointed feel for this kiss it so sweetly rod McClure. be or not to be joshua sutherland alpha bait him kevin meanhan man about town joshua sutherland bad attitude and jade cargo for matt cooper whole point of these races has been totally missed the idea of these was supposed to give the lower trader something to do while breeders cup week was on and uh, they're away and racing but the problem is they obviously haven't qualified or we didn't want to run in it, and we ended up with somebody who's taken some of the group ones over at the Breeders' Cup in this first final, so it's completely missed the point. And be or not to be is in the lead, so you put your money on a Joshua Southern 1 2 in this race, I would think. But it's be or not to be in front, Bad Attitude second, Jade Cargill is third, Man About Town is fourth, then Alpha Bait him and kiss it so sweetly as they pass the three furlong pole. Um, be or not to be, he's in the lead, um, going well, bad attitude on the inside second, there's a six length gap to the rest of them, who are headed by Man About Town, Jade Cargill, Alpha Baiting trying to get down on the inside, kiss it so sweetly is the back marker, but it's be or not to be with a furlong to go, he's in the lead, now being chased hard by Alpha Baiting and stable mate Man About Town, Jade Cargill trying to stick on, Alpha Baiting has hit the front, Grand National one in trainer Kevin Minahan, he's going to take this one I think, up towards the line, so you have Dual forecast and your Joshua Sutherland pair didn't pay off. Mr. Commentator and Alpha Baiting wins it. Man about town and be or not to be. So Alpha Baiting wins it. Or oh, Kevin Meenahan. Man about town second for Joshua Sutherland went off 60. Be or not to be for Joshua Sutherland was third. Bad attitude, Matt Cooper was fourth. And Jane Gargill for Matt Cooper again was fifth.